Hey everyone, so this is Haley while editing in the future from this video. Um, I just wanted to say <laughs> real quick that I missed a lot of days. Um, it's not every single day. It's just when I felt like filming, when I had the energy to film. And I also want to say that this was a really slow week. Um, for me, uh, we weren't really busy um, with the Wise Dog Company or anything like that had a lot going on recently but yeah just wanted to preface that <laughs> I hope you guys enjoy the video bye guys <laughs> no this isn't my car um I'm in my mom's car Ruby is looking out the window right now she's people watching Ruby Ruby come here there she is beautiful girl today she's wearing her active dogs vest um the one that I did an unboxing on uh that little seam tear was never an issue it's not been an issue since we got the vest uh, we haven't worn this vest a whole lot um, but we have been wearing it more uh, recently um, so today we are looking for some interfacing for making Ruby a vest I've been getting into that recently I think it's a lot of fun I don't plan to you know make her a ton of vests or anything like that. I just think if I, we had a few more that it would be pretty cool. I just think it would be fun to make some vests for her. So that's what I've been doing recently. I've been playing around and trying to get new ideas of what a solid little vest would look like for her. So we just went to uh, Joann's to see if they had the type of interfacing that I wanted and they didn't. Um, Today's Sunday, so we were going to go to Hobby Lobby, but they're closed. So we're running out of options because there's not a whole lot of, um, like, fabric stores and things like that. Uh, there's only really those two that I know of around where I live. Um, but my mom is, I'm, so my mom just left. We're at Walmart right now, and I don't do Walmart when I have Ruby with me. Uh, but on a day like today... I'm not going to do it because it's Sunday and there's a lot of people out. That's why they keep distracting me. Um, and that's the time that a lot of pets are going to come in the store. Um, because I've seen at this Walmart, I've been trying to educate them when I do go in and I do see pets. But the past few times that I have been to this store in particular, I've seen too many pets um, for my own comfort. <laughs> uh, just to put it simply... Um, and I've not been a bully or anything like that. You'll never see me, like, tracking somebody down, um, like, following somebody or stalking somebody if they bring a pet into the store, but one of, some of the managers that work here, when I've seen pets, um, you know, handing them an ADA law card and stuff like that, and just explaining to them their own corporate policies and stuff like that, and the fact that, um, they don't even know that on all the entrances of every single door that they have, they have no pets allowed uh, signs and service animal welcome signs. So they don't know that about their own store. So we're going to wait for my mom to get out of the store. They're really busy today. They're, it's it's really busy. Like I said, it's a Sunday. Um, so there's a lot of people out. But we're going to see what my mom can find me. I'm also having her look at some fabric because this Walmart, uh, this Walmart that's close to me, it, um, it has a really good craft section. So I'll see what kind of fabric they have and see if it would be cute for a vest. Um, but yeah. So she just got out from the store and I'm, I'm doing a video. Do you want to say hi? Hello. <laughs> So she just got out from the store, and then is this the interfacing you can use? It says it is. It's pillow. Okay, then yeah, this is the stuff. This is the stuff that we needed. What's this? Oh, that's my delicate. <laughs> this is for you. Yes. <laughs> and then she got me this fabric. Um. I didn't want a whole lot. I just needed a fat quarter because Ruby's not that big of a dog. And I just thought this would be really pretty. I thought this green was really pretty. Uh, green's one of my favorite colors, and so I really like this. Um, so that's what she got. 
she asked him if they had any she facetimed me and she asked him if they had any um webbing or like buckles like straps uh and they they said they said they did and then the lady took her to it and then they did it um so yeah we're leaving now though um thank you mom welcome <laughs> okay bye guys uh today's tuesday um i'm just gonna make this into a weekly vlog last time i talked to you guys it was sunday today's tuesday uh there's lace yeah we're not traveling with a crate today uh we are in josh's truck hey bubby he is um at the vet today i'm gonna get his paperwork talk about that for a second um he was 20 everybody so i just came in from the outside it is super cold out um it is uh, about 6 30 um but i just started up my car so it can warm up um but i am going to go hang out with my mom i'm gonna go pick up my mom and then we're gonna get some food somewhere and then go back to her house and just hang out uh, she doesn't live that far away from me so it's just really convenient um but ruby's gonna come with me and um i'm just putting ruby's uh thick fleece lined sweater on her um i'll probably show a clip whenever we get to my mom's house but yeah guys so we're outside right now i got the dogs there's clover um they're just all off leash doing their own thing as you see, Ruby's got her light on, Clover's got her light on, Lath is not old enough to wear a new collar, or otherwise he would have his light on, but thank God he's a light-colored dog. Um, he's messing over by the wood pile. We need to get that removed. Um, that's from a tree that we chopped down from over there. Um, we're trying to redo that, so we're taking that out, we're going to clean that up, and we're going to clean that up. And then we're going to start building a deck here in the backyard. Um, and then we're, in the summertime, I'm going to put doggy pools here um, so that when we come outside, we can cool down or the dogs can. Um, but yeah, so like I said, that's the sweater that Ruby wears. That's her favorite sweater because it is fleece lined. Um, we got it from... Home goods, I believe, and uh, we love that sweater. But yeah, I am going to probably take a shower and then put the dogs in the crate and go to sleep. All right, Ruby in her crate. We've got Lath in his crate, and we've got Clover in her crate. Now it's time for me to take a shower. One good morning. So today is Wednesday morning. Um, yeah, it's pretty bright out here, as you can tell from my glasses, but um, it's also really cold, so I just, first thing in the morning, I put on some thick pants and my jacket, and I just let the dogs out, and I let them run around for 10 or 15 minutes, uh, depending on how cold it is. Um, so they're doing that now, and it gives them plenty of time to go to the bathroom and stuff like that, um, and just you know, run out some energy, um, of course, you know, it's all, it's all good, because they all are good together, and everything like that, uh, and it gives them some sniffy time, um, you know, first thing in the morning, so it helps them, helps them with that, um, for some good mental stimulation, um, and good structured play, um, but yeah, they're just, Right now, Lath and Ruby are standing in the yard of Clover's up next to me. That's nothing new. Um, she runs off. She was just running around, had the zoomies. Um, but, yeah, I mean, we do this for a little bit, and then I go inside, and I make their breakfast. So, um, it's lunchtime, and I just made myself some lunch. Um, I made, like, potato and corn chowder. Um... I don't know, I like to come up with new recipes all the time. This is what we're working with. It smells really good. Um, it looks really good. I'm excited to try it. And I just cut them into smaller pieces, uh, the potatoes, and then boiled them. And then I added everything else in once they were boiled. And this is what we're doing and it's good now. So I'm going to turn it off and 
I'm gonna serve up a plate for myself. Okay, hey everybody. Um, so today is Friday. Yeah, I know I'm like skipping a day or a few days. I am gonna make myself a snack. Um, today I picked up something that I was so excited to try and I haven't been able to find it, but I found it today at Aldi's. I went shopping for, at Aldi's for the first time ever um, as an adult, and I found the everything but the bagel seasoning. So I am so excited to try this. So I have hard-boiled eggs, um, cream cheese, and pickles. So I'm going to um, do that and then eat it. Um, I'm going to do a little review type thing. I don't know what I'm doing with my hands. I'm going to do a little review on that. Um, but yeah, I'm super excited about this because what I typically do is I, for a snack, I do um, pickles, cream cheese, and like ham. But we don't have any ham. Uh, but I do have hard boiled eggs and I was feeling like a protein type. So the hard boiled eggs will do. I'm going to crack my hard boiled eggs and then I'm going to plate this. So I'm super excited. Okay, guys, so um, <clears throat> I have to use a knife for some of this stuff. So I'm not going to, ow, I'm not going to um, film because I don't know how YouTube's going to deal with that. Um, but I will just show you whenever it's done. So I have my hard boiled eggs peeled. Um, I'm about to cut them and then I'm about to cut my pickles with my knife. So um, yeah, just hold on a second. Okay. So, I'm sorry for this angle. This angle's terrible. So, here it is on a paper plate. I'm about to open this up and um, sprinkle it on. I don't know how much I should put, but I guess we'll see. It smells really good. Okay, here we go. No turning back now. Put some on my eggs, too. Okay, here it is. Oh, damn. I hope that you guys can see. Yeah, you can. You can see it. Um, okay, I'm going to go watch a show or something on Disney Plus or Netflix, like the real adult I am, and then eat this snack, and yeah. Okay, so I just, me editing this again. Hey, guys. So... The pickle with the cream cheese and the everything but the bagel seasoning was delicious. Um, 10 out of 10 would recommend. It is now one of my favorite snacks. Um, I actually ate so much of it that I ran out of pickles. Even though that was a new jar of pickles. And uh, that's an issue because I need to go to the store again. But, yeah. Hey guys, this is another different angle. So, um, today we are... It's Saturday and we are... Josh and I and Ruby are going to go thrift shopping for a little bit. I just want something to do. And then we are going to um, go to the grocery store. So this will be like a day that, you know, Ruby, Josh, and I all go to the grocery store. I don't typically bring Ruby out when I do have Josh with me. I am privileged in that aspect, but um, Today I feel like I need her, so that's what we're going to do. So, yeah. I was trying to get a good angle, but I couldn't. Um, we stopped and we got some Chick-fil-A, so we're just going to eat really quick. And then we're going to then we're gonna go. Yep. Hey, everybody. So, um, I'm sitting in the Aldi's parking lot with Ruby right now because my balance was starting to um, be pretty difficult for me, to put it in simple terms. Um, I've started to have a lot of pain in my left side. So, um, yeah, so I'm not going into Aldi's, um, to walk around that much, because I, it just wouldn't be a good idea. We just got done with, um, sorry, I'm having a lot of brain fog. We just got done with, um, Goodwill, um, and we didn't really find a whole lot that we liked. Um, we found this cute little, um, plate, cute little ceramic plate. I'll show it to you guys. Uh, later, but it has a cat on it, and and uh, it kind of looks like our cat Franklin, so that's why we got it. But yeah, 